For more than 40 years, hydraulic torque wrenches have proven to be an effective and essential part of the maintenance toolkit. Each year, more than 40,000 new hydraulic torque wrenches are sold worldwide into industries such as mining and quarries, earth moving machinery, oil and gas, aviation, wind farms, shipping, locomotive and many other areas of construction and heavy manufacturing. Hydraulic torque wrenches are designed to exert torque on a fastener to achieve proper tightening or loosening of a connection through the use of hydraulics. The tool applies a predetermined, controlled amount of torque to a properly lubricated fastener. Powered by a hydraulic pump, a double-acting cylinder stroking back and forth drives a ratchet. The most dangerous part of a hydraulic torque wrench is the reaction member, often called the reaction arm. When torque is applied to a bolt or nut, the reaction member abuts against a stationary object to stop the wrench from turning around the fastener. This reaction force creates thousands of pounds of pressure. Crushing injuries can be devastating to the hands, even life-threatening if not treated quickly. Often, tendons and nerves located in the fingers and hands will also be affected by a crush injury, leaving a worker permanently disabled. The consequence of catastrophic injury or death of a worker will result in the shutting down of a site until investigations can be conducted. Wages, loss of production and other costs such as airlifting injured personnel from remote job sites can contribute to significant financial losses to a company. The industry standard hierarchy of control gives us an insight as to where the level of protection is required to the worker while using a torque wrench. A common misconception submitted by manufacturers of hydraulic torque wrenches is that the tool can be operated by a single person. 